The stimulus deal includes $284 billion for small business loans, many struggling to pay rent and their employees. Local businesses like Manuel's Tavern and the Colonnade have been waiting months for relief. They've had to resort to fundraisers with loyal customers pitching in what they can to help keep these local landmarks alive. Well, tonight, Tracy A. McPeer shares how a boost from the community is giving the owners of the Colonnade some hope. While the new stimulus package does not include significant support for the hard-hit restaurant industry, there is hope it will help these businesses survive, like the Colonnade on Cheshire Bridge Road, a business and restaurant that's been open for more than 90 years and now is struggling to stay open. When 11 Alive spoke with owner Jody Stallings last week, she said since the pandemic, their business has been down 60 percent. Many of their customers are at the age most worried about and at highest risk for COVID. This Atlanta destination for comfort food even had a GoFundMe page started last week to help them stay open. Their goal was $100,000, and their loyal customers came through. This morning, they had raised above their goal, nearly $110,000. After hearing the news, Stallings had this to say on the GoFundMe page. We were so busy tonight as well, with people saying they were there to support the colonnade. All of the sleepless nights... I'm going to sleep like a baby tonight. And they say they will keep the GoFundMe page open since these are uncertain times and any dollar will help in the months ahead. Thank you, Tracy.